I know a lot of you are responsible for reporting key podcast metrics back to your stakeholders, and bringing all those metrics together in one place is difficult. Well, uh, Transistor has just integrated with Chartable, which I think will make your job a lot easier. Here's how it works. I'll just log into my account here. And you can see I've just done this integration here that puts all of my downloads inside of Chartable. Uh, so far, we just have one here because I just did it. But you'll be able to see you know, where the downloads came from. You'll be able to see what players were used. And you'll also be able to see your uh, ranking in the podcast charts, which I know a lot of you want. Enabling this integration is really easy. I'll show you on a different show here. So this is another podcast I have called Product People. I'm going to click Integrate with Trackable. And now I just need to scroll down and grab my Chartable ID. Now I'm going to head over to Transistor. Here's the podcast I'd like to integrate with. Head over to Show Settings. Scroll down, open the Advanced Settings tab, and then check Enable Chartable Analytics Integration. I'm going to paste in that Chartable ID. Click Save. Now that's updated. Now I just have to head back here and hit Refresh. And now Chartable is collecting data from my podcast here on Transistor. And the way this works is every time someone downloads an episode or listens to an episode, it first redirects to Chartable and then redirects to your actual file. And eventually you'll see that download data reflected here in your Chartable dashboard. We're really excited about this integration. I hope it helps you communicate the value of your podcasts with all of the people on your team.